Okay, what is up guys? Um, right now it is nine o'clock in the morning. It is September 22nd, I believe, 21st. Um, so today is going to be a little bit of a different video. So for the 10 gallon tank, I wanted to go uh, native, like native fish. So I decided to catch catfish. So this pond right here is probably the best place to catch little baby catfish because all they do is breathe. So look, my bobber just went down. See, it's right there. It's going around. Let me go ahead and reel that in. And let's start off the day with the first little catfish. So today I am going for one species and one species only. And that is not this one. This is a bullhead. Pretty sure it's a yellow bullhead. It is not the one that I want. The one that I preferably want is a channel catfish. So I'm going to let that one go. So yeah, like I was saying before I caught that fish, um, all I'm catching really is channel catfish. And I'm gonna be catching a lot of them instead of just one, because I'm gonna be putting a lot more into the pond that I have. Uh, it's a pond that uh, I found. The people allowed me to fish there. I put the fish in there. They've been breeding it over the last few years. But I never recorded it, but I will show you guys how that looks uh, once I get there. But yeah, I'm just going to catch these fish, and then I'll see you guys afterwards. Uh, yeah, right now I'm using chicken breasts as bait. Uh, my mom th thought it out, but then d ended up not cooking it, so it was about to go bad. So she just said I could use it as bait, so that's what I'm going to be catching all of them on. So I'll show you guys the biggest one I catch, and they're all going to be babies, so I'm not really worried about it. But... Yeah, I'll see you guys uh, afterwards. So this is the pond I was telling you guys about. It's pretty big, but it's... I'll tell you the whole story of how I found it and what I've been doing to it lately. And uh, pretty much everything like that. So I'll see you guys when I get back to my dorm. Okay guys, so I'm here with Andrea. I just picked her up from swim practice. Yay. Say hello. Hi. Okay, so this was the mission I was telling you guys about earlier. This pond right here, it goes all the way back that way. It's a great pond. Yeah, there is not a single fish in here. You can ask her. No fishies. I brought her around. She's fishing me plenty of times. Understands where fish usually are. It and says can... no fishing, but there's no fish. Yeah, makes no sense. So, this is going to be our project. We are going to make this into pretty much one of the best places, even though we're not going to fish here. We're going to put fish in here to make it one of the best uh, places uh, just for scenery wise. So, yeah, this whole way here, you can see all in the water, there's no fish. There's a tadpole over there, but there's no fish at all. And that's the first tadpole I've seen, I've been here like six times. But um, yeah, just keeping you guys updated and I'll see you later. Yeah, that's 
Fudge. Oh shoot! Oh, oh Jenny got him. Jenny! No. Jenny, what? what the heck? What the heck? You see it? Yeah. That's cool, isn't it? Take yeah. it. What the Take a picture. Alright, what is up, guys? So, that video. There was multiple things. Um, yeah, the first one, pretty sure whatever order this is in, I forgot. I made the video a couple days ago, or I put it together a couple days ago, but now I'm actually talking to you guys about it. But the lake that I brought my girlfriend to, I've been fishing there for years. And, or not fishing there, but I've stopped by a few, time, a few times over the last few years. I've never seen a single fish in that lake. But there's always ducks in there, there's always uh, frogs in there, but I've never seen a fish in there. I've never seen a dead one, never seen one moving in the shallow parts. And the water's pretty clear, like really clear. And there's algae growing, so I know it's a healthy lake, but uh, nothing's been growing in there. So what me and my girlfriend have been doing, uh, we just stopped what you saw me dump in there was 16 bluegill. So I put 16 bluegill in there, and I'm about to go buy some minnows, put the minnows in there, put enough in there so they have a chance of surviving for a little bit and breeding and everything. And um, yeah, so that's what I did with that one. The second video was me catching a, a, a snapping turtle with uh, the bait I was using for the fishing, which was the, whatever it's called, the, the chicken breast. But as you guys will see, I got rid of the other, 10 gallon tank. I put this in here, but the other 10 gallon tank, I will show you guys another video what I did with that. It's pretty much at my girlfriend's house right now. We just picked up a 60 gallon tank for my friend for free uh, the other day, and uh, my girlfriend's dad went and hurt his truck, went to go pick it up, brought it to his house. Pretty sure it's a 60 gallon. It's either like a 50, 60, so it has to be something within that range. But um, yeah, so we're doing, I'm getting another tank. You guys will see what it looks like. I bought. I just bought. I just bought it. I gotta go pick it up this weekend. Um, I'll make a video of it and uh, I'll show you guys whenever it's ready. Um, what I'm gonna be doing with it. What I'm gonna be putting it with it. It's too big for my dorm. We only have a 30 gallon max in here, so that just gives you an estimate of how big it's gonna be. And then uh, yeah, that's gonna end up going in my room in my house. So um, the fish are doing fine. I had to take out the plants so I can get more substrate to put down because the uh, substrate just kept getting pushed around. Or the plants kept coming up because the substrate was getting pushed around. See, there, there was a mound right there. There's with the fish swimming everywhere. It just kicked it all up. And I have the plants in this tank. They're still alive. They're doing well. Um, but yeah, I just have to, put, I have to go buy substrate. And then uh, that's what we're going to do with that tank. But... Uh, I don't know if I put the names of the fish. I will check that out and then I'll see you guys later. So like, comment, subscribe. Um, see you guys in the next video. Peace.